Welcome folks, I'm Jabby Koi, joined by Char Kirk. Hi guys. The Aquaman trailer just dropped. I've been waiting many, many months for this as well as many of you have. So let's check this out, here we go. My father was a lighthouse keeper. My mother was a queen. But life is a way of bringing people together. He could unite our worlds one day. Check it out, Arthur is talking to the fish. We all can see that the visual effects is not like a, the greatest visual effects, right? But I like the tone that they're going for. I like that it's going more for camp mm -hmm. rather than trying to take itself seriously, which was the problem with um, a number of the Zack Snyder films. I know that there's a number of Zack Snyder fans who might be watching this and might be frustrated that it's not maintaining that tone, but I like that they're deviating from that. I watched them shoot, you know, I was on the set a little bit. I don't know how many of you guys know that, and I will have some behind the scenes stuff, supposedly, coming my way that I can share with you guys at some point soon. And I got to understand what the tone was that they were trying to strike right away. And I'm like, okay, I can totally buy into this because the concept of Aquaman is inherently a little bit silly, and they're just kind of running with that. They're having fun with it, much in the same way that Marvel Marvel ran with Ant-Man, and they're acknowledging that it's a silly concept, and they're having fun with it. Right. Here, they're having fun with it, and I really appreciate that approach to it. I'm just excited to see more of Jason Momoa as Aquaman. He was one of my favorites in Justice League, and I'm glad that he's still got that kind of quippy sense of humor that yeah. you know they introduced in the Justice League movie. You would have never known that he had such a great sense of humor from watching Game of Thrones. Yeah, right? right? <laughs> um, he is one of the nicest guys ever. And so I'm not going to lie that my experience with visiting the set might be coloring my opinion a little bit because I had such a fun time there and I had such a fun time meeting everybody, meeting James Wan and the cast and whatnot. I'm excited for it. And most of the movie takes place underwater. And there were definitely some moments where they spent the money to get the visual effects right. But there were other moments where it's like, well, you know, I still want to watch this. I'm still looking forward to it. And I think that it could be a really fun time. Yeah. Uh, especially with Jason Momoa. He's great. And I think he's a very likable personality. And it's I think it's really going to come through in this film. Yeah, totally. And anyone else at that moment with the turtles, were you guys thinking of uh, <laughs> Finding Nemo as well? Like, yeah, totally tubular. Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Be honest, be verbose. Um, I know that uh, there's a number of people who, were, uh, who are reluctant about this movie. And uh, I'm acknowledging that but I'm still excited and looking forward to watching it. Yeah. Anyways, uh, yeah, let us know your thoughts. Check out Achara Kirk on the social media. Subscribe to the channel and check out our other reactions, reviews, and short films. I'm Jabby Koei. This is Achara Kirk. Peace out.